Making Suggestions in English What do you say when you want to make suggestions in English? This video will give you several tips and phrases to help you get started. Ready? Let's begin. What do you say in the following situations? A friend asks for a suggestion on what he or she should buy. What do you say? Someone asks for your advice on a personal issue. What do you say? Someone asks for your recommendations in a formal meeting. What do you say? A friend asks for suggestions on activities you can do together. What do you say? Your boss asks for suggestions on what the company should do. What do you say? Situation 1. A friend asks for suggestions on buying a particular item. What do you say? Friend. Should I buy the Porsche or the Ferrari? You. What do you say? Think about it for a minute. I think you should buy the Ferrari. Why is that? Because I'd like to borrow it. The easiest way to make a suggestion is to say, I think you should. You can also say, Maybe you should buy the Porsche. Do not say, You should. This is too strong for a suggestion. It sounds like you're telling them what to do, and people don't like to be told what to do. Also, do not say, You had better. That sounds like a warning. If you don't do this, something bad will happen. Tip. When making suggestions, keep it light. Don't be commanding or demanding. Words like, maybe you should, I think you should, help soften the tone for you. For example, I think you should stay home for a while. Maybe you should try meeting new people. Maybe you should go online and find more information. Negative suggestions. In English, we make negative suggestions differently than they do in other languages. We usually say, I don't think you should buy the Ferrari. In other languages, people might say something like, I think you should not. I know that seems more logical, but it isn't as common in English. Situation 2. A friend asked you for advice on a personal issue. What do you say? Should I get a new hairstyle? What do you say? Hmm. If I were you, I wouldn't do it. You look great the way you are. When someone asks for personal advice, you can put yourself in their shoes. If I were you, I would, or I'd, leave it the way it is. Also, you could speak hypothetically, which means imagine the situation. Maybe you could cut it a little shorter. It might be a good idea to let it grow longer. Negatively phrased questions. A strange but common way to make suggestions is with negatively phrased questions. The question is actually a positive suggestion. Why don't you shave your head? This actually means, I think you should shave your head. Why not dye it a different color? This means, maybe you should dye it a different color. Situation 3. Someone asks for your recommendations in a formal meeting. Colleague. What do you suggest? What do you recommend? What do you say?
In this case, you can directly straight state your suggestions. I recommend that we advertise on social media. That's a great idea. Any other suggestions? What about holding a big event to promote our products? In these situations, you can sometimes speak hypothetically. What would you recommend? What would you suggest? I would recommend doing a customer survey. Sounds like a good idea. In some meetings, a more informal approach is fine. What are your ideas on this? Or, do you have any suggestions? I think we should assign that to marketing. Or, it might be a good idea to hire an advertising firm. Situation 4. A friend wants your ideas on doing something together. What do you want to do this weekend? What do you say? In this case, change the pronoun to we. I think we should go to the ball game. Maybe we should take a road trip. Why don't we go ice skating? You can also say simply, let's go bowling. Why not catch a movie? How about going swimming? Situation 5. Your boss asks for ideas on what the company should do. What is the best way to handle this? What do you say? Use we to make suggestions for the company. You are part of the group. I suggest that we hold a press conference. I recommend that we hold a press conference. Or, maybe we should hire a public relations firm. Note, we have another video on making formal suggestions and recommendations. Check it out at the link below. Making suggestions. To recap, here are some phrases for giving advice or suggestions to another person in informal situations. I think you should. Maybe you should. Why don't you? Why not? If I were you, I would. It might be a good idea to. I don't think you should. Suggesting an activity together. Here are some phrases for giving suggestions for a shared activity. I think we should. Maybe we should. Why don't we? Why not? How about? Let's. In more formal situations, for example, in business meetings, you might say something like this. These are more formal. I suggest that we, I recommend, my recommendation is, I would suggest, also okay, in some meetings, this is less formal, I think we should, maybe we should, we could, what about? Practice making suggestions in the following situations. Your friend asks for advice in choosing a pet. Your classmate asks for suggestions in doing an assignment. Your coworker asks for recommendations on a particular project. Your boss asks for recommendations on what the company should do. Your girlfriend or boyfriend asks for suggestions for a weekend activity. Your friend asks for help with a personal problem. Your mother asks for ideas in decorating the house. 
Your roommate asks for advice about choosing a major. Your brother or sister asks for advice in dealing with teenagers. Think about these situations and role play some of them with a partner. I think you should take more time on this. Feel free to pause the video and practice these situations together. Let's talk. I think you should. Go ahead. Think of some situations and make suggestions. Take as much time as you need. Hope you enjoyed that. If you liked the video or learned something new from it, why not give it a thumbs up in the comment section below? And how about subscribing to our channel? Thanks for watching. If you have any ideas for our next video, maybe you should send them to us at the link below. Just a suggestion. This video was brought to you by the following English learning websites.